I am Adi Jithani, a 17-year-old student from Dhirubhai Ambani International School and this is my video report for Tribes for Good. Ever since I was young, I have been heavily involved in social work, whether this is with NGOs or with private individuals, I have helped them with technology and personal life, education, mentoring and so on. But fundraising was always a problem because it required individual events and only worked with people you knew. When I came across the idea of the social stock exchange, it inspired me because I thought it was a brilliant platform that would allow me to connect NGOs to investors nationwide and it was that's why I decided to learn about it and spread awareness about it. In my eyes, one of the biggest problems that concern modern day India is financial illiteracy. Whether it is in rural villages or urban cities, families and especially women do not have the knowledge required to effectively manage their finances, whether it is saving, investing, this is not known to them and therefore it perpetuates cycles of poverty and it limits economic growth. In fact, we have a lot of NGOs that are working towards solving these problems. However, at the grassroots level, they don't have an access to reliable funding options such like companies do, like the, such as the National Stock Exchange or the Bombay Stock Exchange. This lack of a reliable financial source hampers their ability to p continue doing social work and creating the impact that they do in our country. My team and I created two presentations, one about personal finance and the other about starting up a business. When teaching financial literacy, these are the two fundamental concepts that, that must be covered considering saving, budgeting and investment. And from a business perspective, considering costs, profit, marketing, location, and so on. With these presentations and our knowledge, we pitched to the students at ThinkSharp Foundation. We held these vir virtual fieldwork sessions so that we can spread our knowledge and help them gain this basic understanding about financial literacy. Furthermore, to tackle the problem of social inequity between NGOs and companies, um, considering the lack of reliable funding options for NGOs, I wrote an article about the social stock exchange, which is targeted towards an audience of potential investors on the social stock exchange. Through this, I hope to raise awareness about the SSE and convince people to make a, create a social impact through the platform and help create a reliable funding source for the NGOs. Additionally, con convincing NGOs to sign up on this platform with another team member, I created a pitch about the social stock exchange that we then presented to Chaitanya Yakul and the Rainbow Foundation. We helped them realize the true benefits of registering and listing on the social stock exchange as a way of raising awareness to the NGOs. Granted that through actions such as virtual fieldwork sessions or presenting to NGOs, the results may not be immediately obvious. However, there were a few key outcomes through these interactions, such as when the children in the virtual fieldwork sessions were taught about the business. Towards the end of the session, they were very excited and promptly suggesting their ideas about how to start up a business. And I could truly see the impact that the presentation gave them about a path forward and a way to start up a business. Through raising awareness about the social stock exchange, I know that NGOs will get interested. They can look to register and sign up. The NGOs that we pitched to showed interest in registering on the social stock exchange because they get enhanced visibility and they get uh, credibility as it shows that they are now listed on the social stock exchange. In addition to having a wider donation base as a whole nation is can donate to them rather than simply limiting themselves to their contacts. I don't plan to limit my work simply to this program. Throughout my years, I have had many contacts with NGOs. Now, with the knowledge about this social stock exchange, I will again go and present to them the idea of this reliable funding source and create an impact in my own locality.